Using transparent pigments of watercolor in layers that glow, Kate Kimberly is interested in capturing some of our disappearing landscapes. I do a lot of painting early in the morning. You just get totally lost in creating a painting. Um, you don't think about anything else. You just enjoy the color and the way it's coming together or not. Sometimes it doesn't come together too well. You know, every painting isn't a success, um, but it's, it's just something I love. Susan McCarroll wants you to think when you see her shadow boxes and imagine a story from your past. There's lots of uh, past images that I use, old images, and then I kind of recreate them to make um, something, uh, a little fantasy uh, scene. When I travel around, I tend to pick up a lot of things that are old, and um, this is an old musical piece. And I also do a lot of image transferring onto canvas and onto wood panel, and uh, a lot of these uh, images are from people's past. The work of elementary school teacher Liz Marshall is full of whimsy. Three pieces behind me, they're quite playful, and I have a thing about trying to draw a bit like a child, so I will sometimes pull in a little image from my granddaughter's drawings, but it, it's, it's working, it's something to get uh, an interesting composition, but it's still uh, an innocence or a naivete in it. Penticton pioneer Jill Lear Salter is one of the community's most prolific watercolor artists. I love the Okanagan and I love nature and I'm with nature. I feel as though I'm part of it when I'm painting and it helps, it's inspiring. For one thing, I'm very fond of doing the atmosphere, the clouds, and if there's a, the stormer, stormier, the better. If there's a big rainstorm or thunder, lightning, that's good too. It's emotionally stimulating. Newcomer to Penticton, Johan Wessels was an art and history professor in South Africa. Some of his work is unusual, to say the least. I like to surprise people by the way I work. There are hidden things, doors that open, panels that slide open, um, sometimes unusual connections between objects in the picture. Um, I like it to entertain. I like the idea that you can load a lot of different artworks into one piece. Uh, it has different guises and you can change it. Uh, so you're not just stuck with one picture that looks the same all the time. I don't particularly paint things only because they're beautiful. I paint things to tell a story. The works of these and other member artists are on exhibit at the Tumbleweed Gallery on Main Street in Penticton. For Go Okanagan, I'm Wayne McDougall.